Lock and Book. Welcome back to another aviation vlog. So today I will be um, reviewing um, Qantas 747 um, Economy class um, from Tokyo to Sydney. So I'm very excited from this, uh, for this one. Unfortunately my time has ended in Japan but I um, will definitely come back here. It's a great country. Um, so we are at Haneda Airport right now. Um, they've got Tokyo's got two airports: Narita Airport and Haneda. Um, Sydney, um, Tokyo to Sydney and Sydney to Tokyo flights on Qantas only fly to um, Haneda. I don't know why, and I think ANA does the same. And I don't know about JAL if they do Narita. Um, JAL is Japan Airlines. I don't know if they do. Um, Narita or Haneda, but anyway, um, unfortunately my time has ended. I will definitely visit here again though. Um, but otherwise, um, this is Qantas check-in here. Um, I don't need to check in. I've already checked in on my phone. Um, so um, yes, yeah, so we can go for a security now. Um, I would suggest for you to get the app. Um, that's how you can check in. So you have to get the app first, then you can check in. Um, but otherwise, um, yeah. All right, let's get started. So so okay, guys. So I just got through security. I would give security a 10 out of 10 here. It was really, 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 really. Really, like I could say really ten times more it was really good um it was probably like Singapore Airport's one Changi Airport um it was just amazing um so it's just really good how they like process everything but it's just I would give it a 10 out of 10 really good and it, everything just went smoothly and just quickly so okay so so guys we are boarding so we are boarding in 10 minutes. If you are flying on Qantas Business Class or Premium Economy, you get to board first. As you see here, this is a sneak peek of Premium Economy. If you are an economy passenger, you get to board last. Unfortunately, I got to board last. As you see here, this is my seat. Then as you see here, this is my window view. I'm very glad with the window view. Up in the sky would be really nice. So my seat comes with a pillow and it comes with a nice blanket um, to um, snuggle in. Um, this is my TV here. As you see, my QF Entertainment. Then review the table. Um, I would say the table is um, the A331 I like better. It's more bigger. Um, but um, the table was pretty decent but it's fine then if you see here this is the um Qantas entertainment um I would say I do like the um selection it's a very 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 good selection of um movies um but I hate the touch screen um sometimes you have to press very hard but if you press too hard sometimes you have to um reboot it um get the flight attendants to reboot it now it's time to review the headdress the headdress is very good at, um on Qantas I really like the headdresses on any um aircraft on Qantas 10 out of 10 um it was a bit big for my head also before before takeoff I notice this charging pod without a light which is a big pain if it's got a light it means um if it's green it means it's working but if it's red it doesn't so you never know it's working but at least um they've got a charging pod but I didn't really have to use it um as I tried to use it for my camera battery but I um couldn't now it's time to push back we push back 15 minutes before takeoff and taxing onto and um 10 minutes before taxing onto the runway it was a very nice tax taxi onto the runway now if you see here this is the Qantas safety video the um, Australian version is always I should say the English version um Qantas um safety video is one of my favorite um in the world um aer airplane then if, if you're flying out of Japan or into Japan on Qantas there is a Japanese safety
be back. I'll try and be back next year. Japan was definitely great and I'm coming back to visit you again. Okay, 30,000 feet up high in the sky, it was time to review the um, bathroom. So as you see here, there was a mirror, then behind me was a longer mirror. Um, and here um, is a basin, toilet, and if you saw above it was a baby change, and here is some soap. I'm very sorry if I went too fast and too close to everything. I really need a tripod. If you know a place to get um, a tripod in Sydney, please let me know and comment down below for my Canon G7X Mark V. Okay, before you knew it, it was dinner time. I had a very hungry belly. Okay, so as you know, I got the teriyaki chicken with steamed rice and with the garlic bun and the red velvet um, cake for dessert. So um, I tried the chicken and it was very nice, 10 out of 10. Carrot, very good, 8 out of 10. Rice, um, 7 out of 10. Garlic bun, um, 8 out of 10. I review it at 8 out of 10. Now it's time to eat the um pudding. Um, The pudding, I give it an um, 8 out of 10. Very, very good. The top wasn't a very nice, but the bottom where the cake was, was very nice. Okay, so, so guys, I'll probably say um, good night now. I will see you tomorrow morning. Um, I'll still on this plane um, by tomorrow morning, but just gonna have a little rest. morning guys from 30,000 feet up high in the sky. I'm very sorry I had to voice um, over this as um, something was wrong with um, the voice. Um, so I had a perfect sleep, um, very good leg room for me for tiny people like me. For my dad, he's very tall um, in the aisle seat he, as he usually sits on the aisle seat. Um, but he didn't have a good sleep unfortunately, which is really weird. Okay, so this is what was for breakfast. I got the blueberry muffin with a little bit of um, fruit platter, as you know I probably did didn't review the fruit platter as I'm not a real fan of fruit but I need to catch up on some fruit so I got the blueberry muffin as I as I told you earlier then I got um the drink the drink was some apple juice the blueberry muffin beautiful 10 out of 10 very hot though. Hey guys, we are descending back into my hotel into Sydney. No, I don't want to go back into my sit into Sydney. I love Japan. Japan has been great. One of my favourite countries. Okay, I can see my house, I think. Okay guys, thank you for watching this video so much. Please hit the like button, subscribe. Um, and um, yeah, so just to say the review, I give it an 8 out of 10, pretty good. My dad didn't really like it because he didn't have much leg room. And um, that was a bit of a pain for him. So he said next time we um, he's going to go premium economy. And I'm, he said I can join with him if I can. Anyway, um, so thank you guys for watching this video. Um, the TV, like what I said, um, the touch screen, 
not good at all. I do not like that. Um, the, um, what's it called? The, um, table, pretty decent. Um, the leg room for me, it was pretty good. Um, probably one of the best so far. Um, the food was great. 10 out of 10 for the food. Um, the cabin crew, 10 out of 10. I always, the reason fly, I fly Qantas is because it's safe and because of the cabin crew, how nice they are. So, yeah, thank you for watching this video, though. Please like my um, Facebook and Instagram account, Lachlan Brook Travels. And otherwise, have a nice day and night, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!